The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Introducing first, from Charlotte, North Carolina, weighing in at 234 pounds, the Nature Boy, Rip Flair. People ask, who do you think is the greatest champion of all time? To me, it's a toss-up. It's either Ric Flair or Shawn Michaels. Flair dominated the 80s as no one has ever dominated a decade. Shawn Michaels dominated the 90s. It took what Flair had done to another level. Well, there have been a lot of guys who've wanted to be like Ric Flair. We can think back to the last 20 years and some of the greatest five-star matches and match of the year candidates. And one common denominator is that they usually had either Ric Flair or Shawn Michaels in them. And that's why this match is almost guaranteed to be special. I love it. The Texas crowd does too, Kay. The cheers for HBK already starting up from his home state fans. But you can hear that Flair has his cult following too, as always. He hits the drop kick from an incredible vertical leap. Ric Flair, as we all know, is the master of the figure four leg lock. Likes to get you on the ground and work the legs. And when he decides to focus on the legs, Flair can dissect those legs like a surgeon. Oh, well, you said it, Cole. When Flair decides to work on your legs, you're pretty much history. You're pretty much toast. You know, we can talk all day about Flair's figure four leg lock, but he really can work the legs in a whole variety of ways if he wants to. And Shawn Michaels has seen Nathan Boy's boots thousands of times, has watched all of Flair's matches, so he knows what to look out for. Swinging neck breaker. His shoulder just collided into the ring post. He's enjoying this. Well, this isn't the first time these men have been in the ring together, but it is the first time Ric Flair and Shawn Michaels have squared off one-on-one. -on -one. And it's been building to this, King. Shawn Michaels and the Nature Boy were on opposite sides of a six-man tag team match at Backlash just a few months ago. And since then, Things have gotten very ugly between them. Well, maybe things have gotten ugly between Ric Flair and Shawn Michaels since Backlash, but it was only the Nature Boy doing what he needed to do. You mean sucker punching Shawn on Raw two weeks ago? Yeah. Maybe it was something Ric Flair needed to do, but I'm not sure it was something he should have done. He drops the elbow. He's putting those educated feet to good use. Cole, what's he got in mind? Ow! Ooh. And Ric Flair reverses it. That's it. He's out. Look at those eyes. The opportunity. And Shawn Michaels is rolling. Oh, and he's cut off. As quickly as he was coming back, it's over just like that. He is slowly getting... Watch it! Shawn Michaels hit that one. I don't like how slow he is to react right now.
And he gets out of the way. Oh, out of nowhere! You know, Shawn Michaels might be as athletic a superstar as we have in WWE today. And that's always the one thing to watch out for in a Shawn Michaels match. With his athleticism, HBK has the ability to dictate the pace of a match, like a fast-break basketball team. Well, that's if he gets going, Cole. Ric Flair is doing everything he can to prevent Shawn Michaels from getting any kind of momentum in this match. into the table. You know, Ric Flair would love to get Shawn Michaels into the corner as often as he can tonight. Try to take away Shawn's speed advantage as much as possible. But even if Ric Flair... And his head gets slammed back into the table. Shawn Michaels gets out of that one. Nice move. And we're going back between the ropes. Just trying to goad his opponent into... And it's imperative he gets back in the ring right now. Eight. And he gets back in the ring. Great counter. Watch out. Oh, no, look at Flair. Flair's hurt bad. Hang in there, Nate. There's the cover. Can he do it? Three. Shawn Michaels has done it. Taking down his idol, Ric Flair. Oh, uh, Shawn Michaels should be ashamed. No respect for the nature boy. We can think back to the last 20 years and some of the greatest five-star matches and match of the year candidates. And one common denominator is that they usually had either Ric Flair or Shawn Michaels in them. And that's why this match is almost guaranteed to be special. I love it. The Texas crowd does too, King. The cheers for HBK already starting up from his home state fans. But you can hear that Flair has his cult following too, as always. Collar and elbow battling for control. Another great kick. That'll leave a mark. And Ric Flair reverses it. Well, this isn't the first time these men have been in the ring together, but it is the first time Ric Flair and Shawn Michaels have squared off one-on-one. -on -one. And it's been building to this, King. Shawn Michaels and the Nature Boy were on opposite sides of a six-man tag team match at Backlash just a few months ago. And since then, things have gotten very ugly between them. Well, maybe things have gotten ugly between Ric Flair and Shawn Michaels since Backlash, but it was only the Nature Boy doing what he needed to do. You mean sucker punching Shawn on Raw two weeks ago? Yeah. Maybe it was something Ric Flair needed to do, but I'm not sure it was something he should have done. Oh, HBK hits a huge elbow. Big kick echoing around the arena. Backdrop, and that was a nasty landing. It was just a little over two years ago that we saw one of the greatest events in WWE history held right here in Houston, WrestleMania 18. Well, there's always been a rich history between WWE and the state of Texas, Cole, and this incredible event is just going to add one more chapter to that book. Yeah, and I live here. Six. And it's imperative he gets back in the ring right now. And the raw emotion is just pouring out of Shawn Michaels. No. And he's heading back in. He was able to reverse that. Wow, oh, Ric Flair, the dirtiest player in the game, is going to do whatever it takes to put Shawn Michaels in his place here tonight. Flair is just so confident. Some would say borderline arrogant, but boy, so confident. Well, believe me, Flair is arrogant, and he doesn't apologize for it. He's the nature boy. 
the opportunistic veteran in the ring today, Nature Boy Ric Flair, who's overcome it all. 16-time world champion. Survived a horrific plane crash years ago when he suffered a broken back. And not many people thought that Ric Flair would ever come back to WWE after that. But not only did he come back, he came back to dominate. Can you imagine coming back from a plane crash like that? Ric Flair scores with a tremendous move. You know, Shawn Michaels might be as athletic a superstar as we have in WWE today. And that's always the one thing to watch out for in a Shawn Michaels match. With his athleticism, HBK has the ability to dictate the pace of a match, like a fast-break basketball team. Oh, no! Is that a two? A big collision with that restraining wall. Well, in the events leading up to this match, Shawn Michaels brought tears to Nature Boy's eyes by telling him how he idolized Ric Flair, nearly worshipped Ric Flair. But King Shawn eventually got stabbed in the back. Are we moments away from a countout? And this is going to return to the ring. And now it's Ric Flair with momentum. And he's displaying tremendous viciousness. Ooh, what a vicious backbreaker. Rolling out of harm's way. Smart strategy there. Backdrop. Remorseless. That's what that is. But we've seen Nature Boy reach even deeper into his bag of tricks tonight than he usually does. Desperate people do desperate things, and Ric Flair needs to win this match here tonight. And we all know what kind of tactics Ric Flair can call on when he's desperate. That's it. He's done. Playing mind games. Yeah. A little intimidation there. Just look at this. You can see the results from that move. And it's imperative he gets back in the ring right now. Back into the ring now. Michaels reverses it. Oh, throw it in half. And he reversed it. Good move there. Oh, what a chop. Ric Flair, as we all know, is the master of the figure four leg lock. Likes to get you on the ground and work the legs. And when he decides to focus on the legs, Flair can dissect those legs like a surgeon. Oh, you said it, Cole. When Flair decides to work on your legs, you're pretty much history. Look at this. Ric Flair with the figure four, but no! Shot right into the official. And now Shawn Michaels is ready to go. Oh! And he's tuning up the band for some sweet chin music on Nate. Look out, Nature Boy. And he connects. Who the man. heck? Randy Orton with a steel chair to the back of Shawn Michaels. And look at this. He's putting Nature Boy on top of HBK. The youngest member of Evolution. Are you kidding? Helping the referee. His, his buddy Flair. And there's the three count. I can't believe this, Cole! No, I can't. That's the way these guys operate. The Nature Boy, Ric Flair, is he's almost unconscious. There's no way he could have won this match over Shawn Michaels without the help of Randy Orton. Ric Flair can barely stand, but... Shawn Michaels is out. Orton paying dividends. 